The National Hospital Insurance Fund, that is NHIF, Chairman Lewis Nguyai has said that the insurer is running losses due to several dormant accounts. Currently, the, uh, the country has 10.4 million Kenyans registered with NHIF. However, only 5.1 million Kenyans are actively paying their monthly contributions. Sheila Ngetich filed this report. A bill tabled in Parliament seeks to make it compulsory for Kenyans 18 and above to enroll and contribute 500 shillings per month to the primary state insurer. Bill returns in Kiari, but when I take any two pesa, ya kulipe NHIF. We are going to get it. Consequently, NHIF, in its quest to fulfill the Big Four agenda, is seeking to register more people. But just how logical is it to register more people, yet more than half of those registered are dormant? How do the losses come about with the dormant accounts? So for an insurance company, you want to have a big pool of contributors eh? so that you can have enough funding so that you're able to pay for all the services that are, that are there. Challenges faced by Kenyans when accessing health services are prompting the slow response in actively contributing. When you have less members contributing and more, more people who are claiming uh, for, for benefits in terms of when they are seeking services, it means that you're paying more, for, you're paying a lot of, for the services, but you're not able to get the, the funding from the people who are supposed to pay. One question, however, is with the mass registration, how then are the services under the cover going to be affected? Linking that to NHIF enables the government even to identify those who are vulnerable or, or indigent groups so that they're able to be funded or to be paid for services because I believe that, is a, that would be the nature of a social insurance where those who are able to pay are identified and they pay mandatorily and those who are not, government is able to subsidize. Efforts by the government to merge all services under the Huduma card is expected to ease the reach of health services. If majority of Kenyans are covered, it means that one, you will achieve universal health coverage where you'll be able to access health services, whether you're rich or poor. So, uh, and then secondly is in terms of um, NHIF and itself being able to fund services. NHIF will be able to fund more services if more of us contribute because the pool is bigger, so the amount of money they have is, uh, is larger. The defaulting of monthly NHIF contributions have been attributed to the tough times as a result of the pandemic. However, health experts continue to urge Kenyans to pay up in the event of sickness. Shilangatich, Switch TV, Nairobi.